What's up? It's Raya and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe down below, give this video a like, and we'll get right on into the video. In today's video, I'm going to be doing like a Depop unboxing or haul, like both of those things. And I'll be trying on all the pieces so you can see exactly what they look like. I've never ordered from Depop before, but I saw a couple of my favorite YouTubers who had recently ordered from there. Nikki DiMartino, I love her, and then Adeline Warren. They both talked about how much they love ordering from Depop, and then I was like, oh, maybe I should check it out. And I did, and I did some damage. So you guys are gonna get to see everything that I ordered. Here are all the packages that I have to show you guys. And I will make sure to link the shops down below in case you wanna check out the shops. A lot of sellers on Depop will sell vintage clothes. So some of these items are vintage and obviously used. And a lot of Depop sellers will sell different sizes too. So that's why I'll link them down below because you never know what someone could have because they just go out shopping, find any size and then try to resell it. But let's just get on into opening all this stuff up because I'm so excited to see what's in it. I kind of forget some of the things that I ordered, but I'm also remembering some really exciting things. And I waited to open them up for this video and I've had all these packages for almost a week now. So that was really hard to refrain from opening them before, but let's get right on into it. So I guess I'll just start with the smallest package. I know exactly what's in here. I ordered some jewelry. And since I'm filming on my phone, I can't really look at what the shop names were, but if they aren't on the packaging or in the packaging, I will make sure to put the name up on the screen somewhere. Oh, that's so funny. They like took a different package, like a USPS package and turned it inside out. Anyways, so I got a few pairs of earrings, which I might have to wear a pair now today. They packaged really well because I really need scissors to get this all open. So I got three pairs of earrings and I will show you each of them. This pair might be the pair that I wear today because it's a nice spring day and they're butterflies. I got this pair of dangly earrings that are butterflies and then they have jewels that go on the hoop itself. Oh my goodness. Did you guys just see that? The earring fell apart. Oh no, that is not how I wanted to start this. Oh my. <laughs> well, I'm going to have to fix that, but that's what it's supposed to look like. Not starting off that well. <laughs> and then I got these two pairs because she sold them as like one of each as a set. But then she had a deal where if you bought three, you got like a certain percentage off. So that's why I bought both sets, so I could either wear them together or separately. I got little moon dangly earrings, and then I got a pair of star dangly earrings. A little star. And then on her shop, I saw that she sells a set where you wear one star and one moon together. So that's why I got two pairs so that I could do that or I could just wear them individually. That's the first shop and those are the three pairs of earrings I got. I'm gonna have to fix the butterfly earrings, but that's okay, that's okay. So next I'll open up this green package. I also don't know what shop this is because it doesn't say it on the outside. The packaging is so cute with little palm trees. Ooh, oh, they sent candy. Oh, that's so cute. That's what a lot of people say that they like about Depop is that they send little like cute messages and things. But I got these guava candies. I think I've had them before from a Japanese restaurant. And then she sent a note saying thank you. And she said, Rhea, thank you so much for shopping sustainably with me. Any feedback slash review you leave means the world to me. Enjoy. Oh, that's so cute. But I got this shirt it's like a crop top blue tie-dye i thought the tie-dye on it was so cool and it says someone's name in it which is so funny but it's really soft it's like a thick t-shirt and it's cropped and smells good isn't that weird but i really like it i think her website said it was a large but this says an extra large so now i it doesn't look like an extra large though it looks like it'll fit so that's the first shirt that i got from this shop And then I got one other shirt from this shop and it's this beautiful like 
paisley pattern and it's like blue purple teal green and i thought tucked into like high-waisted mom jeans this could be really cool with some cool jewelry and kind of looks grandma-y but i feel like i can style it well here's to hoping that i can but those are the two things that I got from her shop, and I'm pretty sure I paid $18 for both of these. And I think the earrings were $8 each, if I'm not mistaken. So, not a bad deal, and I think they're both really cute, and I've been looking for more just like simple throw-on t-shirt types of things instead of like dressy items. So, I'm excited about those. And she didn't put the shop name anywhere, so I'll put the shop name here and in the description down below. The next package we're gonna open is this cute lemon package. I love how cute it is. And this is from the shop Utterly Jaded. So if you guys wanted to check it out, you definitely could. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited! Oh, they even wrapped this stuff up. I think these are the more vintage style pieces. Oh my goodness! I just love all the little surprises in here. So it is utterly jaded. They said to tag them to show off our goodies. And then I have no idea what this is, but it's this pretty like fairy. And I don't, it looks like it's a sticker. So I'm a little bit confused. Is it a tattoo? Is it like one of those? I don't know. I really don't know. But anyways, let's get into what the package is actually about. And these are both pieces from the 80s, I'm pretty sure. So they have had a lot of love. It's hard to believe that's like 40 years ago. 40? Anyways, I got this piece and it's like a button up shirt and it's purple, yellow, green, maroon. But the inside also has like a built-in shirt. And the way that they styled it really is what sold me on it because it looked really cool. So I'll try to style it the same way. In the try on portion, I will unbutton this. It's taking me a while and then I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. So it has like this built-in tank top and then this is like the button-up shirt on the outside and tucked into like some mom jeans again. I think it will be so cool looking and it's really unique. I don't think there's much out there like it today. Like you can totally tell it's vintage and it has shoulder pads, which I think I'm gonna be cutting out. I don't really need the shoulder pads. That's not what I'm looking for, but it's so, so cool. And the way they styled it was they just tucked it in and like left it unbuttoned so you see the black a lot. That's the first piece that I got from Utterly Jaded. And then this piece I'm also really excited about. It's a denim button up and it's like white and blue stripes. And I thought this was perfect for spring. I thought you could just wear like a white tank underneath and leave it open. You could tuck it into some black jeans. You could wear it over pretty much any color. That's what this is. And it is also from the 80s, I'm pretty sure. And it has like a pocket and these cool buttons because you have like a bunch of buttons at once and then it stops and then there's only one button at the bottom. It's just a really unique piece and you can tell it's also vintage. It's just so, so cool. Oh, I'm so excited. I love that they're selling vintage pieces and that there are still pieces of clothing circulating throughout the world from so many years ago that people are still getting use out of. And it's just like not playing into fast fashion. It's like using fashion that once was cool and it is now cool again. I don't know. It's just really awesome. I see myself buying off of Depop again in the future for sure. But I have another package and this one's from Juju's Closet. And it's a 100% compostable packaging, which is really cool. I really think that is awesome. And if someone from Depop can do compostable packaging, so should big companies. That's my opinion. Let's get on in here and see what I got. I'm pretty sure this is a shop where I bought the most items from, like the number of items from, but I also think it was still pretty cheap. Let's see, let's see. So they sent me a little sticker, it looks like. It's like a flower sticker, that's cute. And then she sent 
Thanks for your order from Juju's Closet. That's cute. And she put, besides being a deep pop seller, I'm also a singer-songwriter studying songwriting at Berklee College of Music. It would mean the world to me if you would check out my Instagram or YouTube. And interactions help a lot. Thank you so much for your business, and I hope you have the best day. Oh, that's cool. It's got multiple hustles going on. Awesome. So if you want to check out her music, go ahead. <laughs> Here are all the items that I got from her shop. I got this cute little crop top and it's yellow. I've been really into the color yellow lately. So it's like this cute little yellow crop top with like pink flowers on it and I think it just looks so dainty. I really kind of imagined wearing it underneath this. I think that could be fun. It's like putting two patterns together and it's so so soft. I didn't even imagine it to be this soft. It's just like a really cute girly summer top, so that's the first one that I got. And then the second piece that I got is this cool like red v-neck shirt and then it has a ribbing on the outside that's blue and white and it has it on the sleeves and on the bottom. I thought this looked kind of schoolgirl-esque but I liked that it was like a plain shirt but had cool details on the side. The next piece that I got is this green bodysuit. I really like the color, that's why I went with it. And I really like bodysuits because I tuck in my shirts almost 90% of the time. I really like tucking in my shirts. It's originally from Forever 21, so sometimes they sell vintage stuff and sometimes they sell stuff from fast fashion, but it's kind of like thrifting online instead of in person. And then I got this lace up tank top and it's just like this off white color and then at the bottom you can tie it. And I just thought it was a simple tank top that you could wear under things, tuck into things. I just really liked it. It's originally from American Eagle too. So another like modern brand that I bought off of there. And it's like a sweater material if you can tell. Oh my goodness, I don't even think, this is not what I ordered. This is not what I ordered. I'm sad, I wanted a button up, but that's okay. I got this pink sweater vest. It's like a Tommy sweater vest. I don't know, I didn't order this. I guess I can figure out how to style it, but I ordered something else by this brand, but that's okay. I'm just gonna have to figure out how to style it. I didn't expect that, but there it is. And then the last piece I got, I was really excited for because it was like a vintage style polo with these colorful little like details all over it. They're like little circular mandala types of things. I just thought it'd be really cool. Tucked in and then like the collar open. I don't know, I don't usually wear collared shirts, but I thought I'd give it a try and they're definitely coming in to fashion. So I thought I would try it out. about that one piece being wrong because the other piece I really really liked and then this is the last package and it's so huge because it is jackets I'm not wasting any time I'm just cutting into all of this packaging oh my goodness I'm so excited I kind of forgot what was in here so I don't remember the name of this shop but I will put it up here and they put little butterflies all over the packaging which is cute but I got two jackets from this shop the first jacket is this bright red like windbreaker type of jacket but it also has like sweatshirt material and then it's windbreaker in the middle and you can tell it's like vintage and really cool I think it is awesome it's kind of like a bomber jacket and it's got this big zipper and it's a medium so it'll be maybe a little bit oversized on me, but I was super excited about this. I just thought it was really cool. 
I could see myself wearing it like all winter. Unique, that's what I try to go for with the stuff that I bought was just trying to find unique pieces that you wouldn't like really find in store today. So there's that jacket. And then this last jacket is probably the one I'm most excited for, like the piece that I'm most excited for out of this whole haul. And it is a leather like blazer type of jacket and it has like this white stitching throughout the whole thing, which is what made me think it was a little bit different than a lot of the leather blazers that are being sold right now and I just think it is so cool. Oh, I can't wait to wear it everywhere. Like I'm not even waiting for the try on part. I am just, oh, why do I feel so cool in this? Ah, I'm, I'm so excited to have this. And it has a little wear on one of the sleeves, but like it's old, so I don't even care. It's like a little bit right there. But they pointed that out before they sold it to me. So that's the last piece that I got and that kind of ends our video today. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. This is my first time ordering from Depop and I would say that I am, let's say 85% happy with my order. The only things that like make me a little sad are the butterfly earring literally falling apart on camera <laughs> and then that pink like Polo, I definitely didn't order that. I know exactly what I ordered instead, but it's okay. I bet if I messaged them that they would send it to me anyways. So I will definitely be ordering from Depop again because I think I found some really cool pieces. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to give this video a like down below. Subscribe to keep up with me and my upcoming videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Oh, and comment down below if you've ever ordered from Depop, because I would like to know. Anyways, bye!